Let's chat about how to afford nursing school, grad school, or a second bachelor's degree. But before we get started, you guys need to know that this video is sponsored by Stride Funding. So the process of getting a loan for nursing school or grad school or your second bachelor's degree can be very, very stressful. Trying to figure out who should I get the loan from, for what amount, and even bigger, how am I going to pay it back once I graduate. It's like you're chugging through nursing school or grad school and everything's fine and then you graduate and boom, now you're faced with like a new career path, you're starting a new job, oh and by the way, you gotta pay back your loans. Unfortunately, there can be a lot of limited options for those students who are going back to nursing school after already having it, their first bachelor's degree or for those who are going to grad school when you're trying to look for funding. But that's why I wanna share an amazing resource with you guys called Stride Funding, who's going to help you pay less faster. It's time to rethink how you're gonna pay for school. Stride Funding offers an affordable, flexible, and supportive way to help you pay for your healthcare education. And they do this with income share agreements, also known as ISAs. And I was like, what the heck is an ISA? So let me explain to you guys what that is. An ISA offers students an innovative alternative to traditional student loans. With an ISA, you pay a small percentage of your future income with rates based on what you're expected to earn. With ISAs, you never pay more than you can afford because you're always just paying that small percentage of whatever your income is. There's no interest no principal amount or anything. So you're just paying that small percentage of your income over a short period of time. ISAs are considerably more flexible than traditional student loans because you can pause payments if you lose your job or have other life circumstances happen. And you can delay payments from starting if you make less than 40K a year. So here are some of my favorite parts about Stride Funding. You pay off your loan in a shorter duration, around five years versus a traditional student loan, which is about 10 years. Payments are based on a fixed percentage of your future income, no interest payments. You get a grace period after you graduate before payments begin, so you're not like struggling right after you graduate to find a job to start paying off your loan payments. You have that little bit of flexibility and time before you have to start paying. There's an automatic deferral for periods where you may be unemployed or you're making below the minimum threshold of 30 to 40K a year, depending on the program. There's no co-signer required for students, and they're more affordable than most graduate student loans, private and grad plus, with no fees. ISAs are more important in this environment now more than ever because students are looking to go back to school, improve their skills, expand their education, etc. Students are rightfully so very wary about what their financial situation is gonna look like after they graduate. That's why it's perfect to have a Stride ASA so you know what your payments are gonna be, you have that flexibility, and you'll know you can always afford what you're gonna pay. It's really awesome to know that there's options and resources for you guys like Stride Funding to help you afford nursing school, or maybe you already have a bachelor's degree you're going back for a second bachelor's degree or going to grad school. That's why I'm glad to be sharing a great resource for you guys like Stride Funding. If you're interested in them, check them out down below. I have their link for you to click on. Thank you Stride Funding for sponsoring this video. If you guys have any questions, leave them down below and I will do my best to answer them for you. I know this is a very confusing topic, talking about finances, it can be stressful, and that's why I wanted to share this resource with you guys so that way I can make it hopefully less stressful for you. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you next time. Bye.